Hello everyone, this is Adam from Newfie.com and today we're going to play Fire Shock Evident Burial of Sea Episode 1. Now Episode 2 just came out, if you read my review, you know that I already liked it. Uh, let's see, new game. Yes. Hell no, I'm playing on medium. I tried to beat this on, actually I did beat it on 1999 mode, it was absolutely insane. The uh, ammo scarcity and incredible lack of uh, usable commodities is amazing. So I really don't want to have to go through that again, plus there's no achievement linked to it. But like uh, I said, Burial, let's see episode 1. It's, uh, yeah, it's a sequel to uh, Bioshock Infinite's original campaign. <coughs> Sorry. And it takes place in the city of Rapture. It does have a very massive twist at the end. I'm not going to spoil it just in case you guys are watching this for the first time. But if you read my review for Barrel, let's see episode 2, you already know what's going to happen. So, who do we play here? We play as Booker DeWitt once again. <laughs> and here we are in the under. Uh, we are on the other water city of Rapture once again. There's Elizabeth. Taught We're closed. Here. Close. You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. And she's in like she has all that going on for her. But I guess she does. I never really found Elizabeth attractive. That's How my about we start with a point light? of view, though. I do like her new look, this. though. It's very edgy. Elizabeth. Her other look was too innocent. It just didn't really click with me. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her. This girl. This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. With Fontaine's charity shut. No place for them. But her you As know. I said, girl's dead. Lost. Look, I don't know where you get... Lost isn't dead. Name your radar, I will pay you for this work. But you do this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you A private will. detective, you would soon Booker would put two and two together. I mean, she knows that he, misses, he knows this girl, and she knows that he'll do this gratis. Seems a little crazy. I better leave here and get back to the underwater city of Rapture. Here we go. No gods, no kings, only man. The iconic line from the open of Bioshock 1. Seems my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know. But I know someone who does. Follow me. That guy's a freaking nut job. He was the number one guy who genuinely scared me in uh, the original Bioshock. What's this girl to you? I wonder if that's the same whale from the opening scene from Bioshock. Or probably to the Leviathan from, Bio uh, from Dishonored. You never know. I have a theory about that, but a lot of people already have that theory that the Leviathan is the outsider, and the outsider is basically a giant whale that lives underneath the sea. I'm almost certain that's true. I mean, they have a big imprinence on, whale on whales. I'm not going to stay too long here. I'm going to try and rush through this as quickly as possible. I know that doesn't seem logical, but you know, I played through this and go through it again. Just doesn't seem very entertaining. Hey, keep moving, buddy. Little sisters. What happened to these children? Red what are stop. they? Green Where have you been? Go. Cabin in Arcadia? Little sisters. Atom factories. That's grotesque. I don't know, the little sisters from uh, Bioshock, the original Bioshock were much creepier looking. I mean, they just looked like they had white paint covered in their face. Just a matter of time before Ryan's groove ran up. Yeah, Ryan is, uh, this is at the start of the civil war that's brewing in the uh, Rapture. Everyone is just basically tense from the oncoming calamity from Fontaine and uh, like uh, Ryan. What you mean? Are they just some kind of machine? I love how they got the hook just right there. Oh, I see. <sighs> Get on. Don't vote on it. 
So, like I was saying, Ryan's secret police is basically rounding up anyone who's a threat to his city and destroy and eliminating them. If you played Minerva's Den, there's a really good DLC explaining how innocent pe how uh, people use this to their advantage to eliminate their competition. Also, Rapture is like uh, an example of what would happen if everything went without borders or without limits. Science, industry, and art. Do it. The hostic sees you. He'll toss you out on your ass again. A lot of little girls are going missing. Then again, not a lot of people care because you know it's a parent, but what? they'd rather You're have Adam instead of little, little sisters. sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Let's just say I don't get out much. You've got eyes and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. Dewitt, I would write my memoirs. If I learned anything about Rapture. I thought it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Also, when did Elizabeth take where up smoking? Headed? The man we need to see is in the Garden of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. If he had any information, he would have found her by now. Then again, for a private detective, he's not really asking the right, the right questions. Where are you taking me? When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? She was taken, down at Surprise. You were playing the tables and... She disappeared. And? A cop friend of mine, Sullivan, says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? This world values children, not childhood. How? There's a profit to be made and men who make it. I'm taking And look at that, there is a little billboard showing me that. Mr. Dewitt, you alright? I'm fine. Just get these spells sometimes. It'll pass. Refreshment, sir. Madam? We're fine, thanks. Why, sirs? Uh, we have to go see Sander Coleman. He's gonna let us in to information that we need. Okay, this guy. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, they are real people. I thought they were just animatronic statues. My source inside that club. Cohen? What does that lunatic have to do with Sally? Which business do you represent, sir? Uh, business? Yes, which business? DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the artist struggle. We're expected. No mask, no entry. Stuff shirt. These invitation masks he spoke of. They must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of Rapture is a business. This is sponsored by the Artist Struggle, the Golden Rule, and the Rapture Records. I guess those stores would be as good a place to start as any. I don't have all the flaws in the Alright, so we'll head into the Golden Rule first. Yes, I already know how to play. Oh, Come on. Gone. Alright. What brought you to Rapture? Invitations to Cohen shows are highly coveted. Nobody's gonna just hand us one. You think you can figure out a That's way to distract the store owner while I take a look around? You just find the mask. Leave the distractions to me. Of course. You know, you being the woman and all, but you know, feminism Welcome. aside. Come on, Elizabeth, do your thing. Excuse me. Lady has some questions for you. Yes, of course. I'm interested in this piece. Ah, oh, excellent. You and I, haven't you, miss? It's a natural sapphire and diamond. Eight. Thank you. I'm just gonna walk in while you're distracted. When Cohen sends those masks out in some kind of box. That's a lot of fine talk about a stolen ring. Right out of her coffin in the Twilight Did you think we wouldn't else. notice? The assurances of a grave robber are of no this interest. This is critical. Watch this. If you hand the ring back, the matter will remain between you and me. You come into my shop and talk this trash. I don't think so. <laughs> he hit the lost his accident. Tramp, or I'll see to it they hit you. What happened to your Get accent, your buddy? Hands off me. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Oh, oh. Hmm. Might be best if we were gone when he wakes up. What do you mean when he wakes up? Any luck? Nothing. You just gave him a. Let's uh, find another shop. Circumcision. Whatever that barber did to you. I hope he's retained a capable attorney. Well, thanks. Bitch. So I say. Alright, here we go. Tip. I don't think these supermen know the meaning of the word. 
pig snouts. There's supposed to be an uh, audio diary here that lets me into that room. I have to find that. I really don't care about this. 2076. I had all of these visions before coming down here. It reminds me of the bar in the darkness, Every too. man with his hand on the great chain, the wheel of progress turning. Every cliche you can imagine. And what is the first thing that happens when I open up shop? Petty thievery. Now I have to lock all my valuables in the closet. Remember 2076. Maybe you should put some security cameras. It's a problem with coming to Utopia. Is that it still has the people. There's no such thing as a Utopia. Do you think uh, people aren't going to follow who are desperate? Like uh, Atlas said, there may be... It may be a city gleaming with possibilities, but there's always someone who needs their to to uh, toilet scrubbed. Just hope you're not that person who, who does it. I should listen to this audio diary too. Soup crutch. When Ryan take over Fontaine Futuristics, sin of the terrible violence. Splices burning each other to bits. The lucky ones are not killed, sent to department to stop prison instead. Suchon think he dead man too. But then Ryan comes to Suchong and says, Suchong want to be buried in filthy store or Suchong want to make a good salary? Work for Ryan. How much salary? Asks Suchong. This Ryan find very funny. Wow. Traitor. You see that dish I walked in with? Give her the star treatment, pal. That'll make it worth your while. Of course, right away. What is this piece? It's by... But of course... Come no, I think all those records are going to be digitized box. soon. iTunes and Google Play. Unless Google Play doesn't exist in this world. Dad. Nothing. Oh, something only one place it's left. It's almost... <sighs> The middle, Elizabeth does have some moves. Nothing. No. We've got one place left, though. And if that proves to be fruitless, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Ah, huh? Mr. DeWitt, back again. So soon. I guess you can take Columbia out of uh, Booker DeWitt, but you can't take the alcohol hism from him. What's this? Oh yeah, I remember those. Darkest struggle. Hey pal, you want to help out the little lady? Yes, of course. Dude, your haircut sucks. I mean, look at that. Interesting, you look like Coconut this? Head from Ned Declassified. He calls it Maya. My God, and you're dressed like a oh, dear I'm God, man. Did you even look in the mirror? That box. I know uh, some of you are probably going to say, why didn't I check here first? It's because it doesn't really matter where you check. You have to go to all three of them in order to get the mask. Oh, what do you? You've given me so much to think about. I, I feel a trifle swoony. What do you mind? Good. I've located the mask. Third time to charm. All right. It's best we head back to Cohen's. I guess fall damage still counts here. All right, back to Cohen. I wonder how much these guys get paid. I mean, all they're doing Find is actually like back with complete weird. Oh, wait, they have letters embedded the in there. Sure. For that, you can thank my father. Oh, yeah? He was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. Yes, he was. He included shooting, cutting people's throats, and burning them alive. Uh, enter the club. I'm not going for all those collectibles. I do have a video up for both Burial of the Sea Episode 1 and Episode 2. If you want to check those out, they'll show you where all the collectibles ah, are. Very well. Mr. Cohen awaits your participation at his performance. I'm not looking forward to this. I know what a nut job this guy is. So I've seen the, the first Bioshock game, there's a secret room that you so can go uh, underneath. Cohen? It's filled with Some water sort of underworld figure? and his Worse. splicer minions basically an ambush you. An artist These who really creepy children. statues. Cohen's muse is a bit more diverse. I've seen this type. Gets an idea in his head, end a conversation. Don't matter who gets hurt. 
this place creeps me the hell out. Oh, like I was saying, it reminds me- his work reminds me of Condemned Criminal Origin, the mannequin level. Still freak out about mannequins, those things that come to life and just... Huh. Creepy as hell. Dance, dance, move! He also has an obsession with bunnies. What does that even mean? I mean, I got an A in art history and music education, but even I don't know what the hell this guy's talking about. It's like Kafka all over again. Did he kill those guys? Get them out of here! There shall be no failure on my canvas. Dude, you're wasting a lot of paint. <laughs> oh, there's no room in rapture anymore for the artist. Who are you? Name's DeWitt. Is that right? Wow, this guy probably drinks a lot of Adam. <laughs> this one's a real biscuit. Isn't he a biscuit, lady? I need to ask you a few questions. Questions? Yes. Yes. It is the work of man to ask. It is the work of the artist to that ask. That I actually understand. You've seen this girl, haven't you? We artists see more that than That I don't most. understand. You are more than you claim to be, little soul. Are Either con uh, he has access to information that Watch no one else does, one, or he's DeWitt. really close to Ryan. She'll take you where you don't then want again, to he's go. not sure with Ryan. But I know the child obvious. in that photo is. Well, it's obvious to me when you play Burial C episode so two that he has no idea who Elizabeth is, but Conan seems to. I know where the girl is, and I will send you to her. In exchange, all I ask is a dance. And so you could shock me like those people, no freaking way. I see something in you too. Art strips away artifice. Show me who you are, and I will show you where you need to Listen, go. Cole, you son of a bitch. Mr. DeWitt. What? Dance with me. Why don't we just threaten him? You me. Oh, I never noticed the medallion I on her neck. Think what greater price he might care to extract. Fitzpatrick! Beauty and I don't know if that's the medallion I picked. But then again, no I always pick the bird. I don't really like the cage. What do you think Cohen's customers do with the children? Do they? Sometimes. But those types like the capital of people like Ryan and Sucho. That's a blessing. You saw those little sisters? You so sure? But if Su Chong had Sally, I'd know it. How? As I tied him to a chair and asked him. So? For 15 hours. I don't know what to make you of you, Mr. DeWitt. You would think that Su Chong would want revenge. No, no, no! Listen, we're not gonna keep- Fitzpatrick! You should have gone with the lightning class, but you the best one. Like a reference to Bioshock 2, but okay. The whole idea of rebirth. But I didn't. Again, I would think Sutra would want revenge, but then again, Sutra is very egotistic. Uh, let's see, we're back at Fontaine. It's a department store that was sunk beneath the ocean with Atlas, Ryan's new enemy. And we're here to save Sally. Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt, are you all right? I'm fine. You were dreaming. You kept saying your daughter's name, Sally. She's not my daughter. I thought. Pain and beauty. 
To an artist, they are parent and child. Cohen? I'm sending you to find your young one. <laughs> no need to thank me. Thank you. I'd rather shoot him in the head. I'm not so sure you'll like what you find. One way trip. I do like all the sea creatures they allow us to see. Cool, a shark. Look. Fontaines. Ryan sent the whole thing to the bottom. But it's a prison now. Why would Cohen have sent Sally there? I don't know. Everyone has needs. I merely provide a service for those who have the means to pay. Now I see where you get all this funding your from. Little bird. In the housewares department. He sold Sal he kidnapped Sally Solder to Fountain. How many people do you suppose Ryan's got locked up in that place? Enough. Fontaine had amassed something near an army. Now they're down there, spliced up and wild. Alright, there's a dock up ahead. Pretty sure this thing is on autopilot, but whatever. It takes a cold son of a bitch to do that to a living person. No, what's that? Barry will see. You read your residency contract with Ryan Industries? In perpetuity, we're all buried at sea. True. Even is another option. He'll let you in, but you're not allowed to leave. Or you must share the sequence of its location to the so-called U.S. government. You're too comfortable. Keep your eyes open. Seem to be some supplies this way, Mr. Dewitt. It's Booker. What? Just. Call me Booker. It's all the same to you. Let's leave it at Mr. DeWitt. Ooh, he's a very snippy person. <sighs> I finally figured out the mystery of why my gun is gold, though. It wasn't really a mystery. I downloaded the season past since I wanted to play both Burial. Let's see, episode 1 and episode 2. A lot cheaper this way. I didn't like how they advertised the new uh, plasmids. They were like, oh, new plasmid, something you've never seen before. And I'm like, this is just Frost, Bla uh, Frost Winter Blast from the original Bioshock. It wasn't a great plasmid then, it's still not a great plasmid now. You know what, I'm tired of seeing Screw this. This is why I didn't play 1999 mode again. Had to sneak. Could be handy. Skyhook. Skyhook? You mean the air grabber? Kids use them to ride around up on the pneumo lines. Air grabber? Huh. Constants and variables. Constants and what? Never mind. I like how they give up dangerous pieces of technology to children. We've all seen what the Skyhook can do. It can rip people's necks off. It can uh, split their throats. Mr. DeWitt! Someone's coming! I got this. All right, I got the grabber unjammed. And here myself. Come on, I'm gonna do the execution. I'm looking for something against the wall. There we go. I think I did them a favor. Mr. Dewitt, look. Housewares. That's where Cohen said we'd find Sally. The store ran trams between the three buildings. We'll need to avail ourselves of that. Assuming I wonder why this works. place isn't Optimism, being crushed by Mr. the pressure Dewey. of the ocean. It helps if he sunk it to the bottom, shouldn't, you know, everyone succumb to the bends or oxygen or die from suffocation? I don't know, maybe they have their own uh, system that regulates everything. But it seems like a lot of work to put when so much faith in a prison. Oh, it was... Jeez. Uh, I guess around 51? No. 48? That's a rather large gap. Time. Life I had before. Sort of becomes a blur. 49. 49 for sure. Damn. You look a mess, Mr. DeWitt. Just keep your eyes open for splicers. They can do us a whole lot worse. That's true. Here, little birdies. 
eat it up. Well, it, it's good for you, you know. Well, I've never heard of birds that didn't like seeds. Birds that didn't eat the seeds. What, what's, what's the matter with you? They're not even birds. They're dead rabbits. I, oh no, I was going to shake their hand, Elizabeth. him in the back of the head. He is wearing a box crate for a helmet. Uh, aim and fire. I'll shoot you. Come here. Alright, head to the second floor. I really hope this DLC doesn't uh, glitch. Mr. DeWitt, look. Well, there's the tram. That Splicer had no problem freezing a path for himself before. I'm sure he'll be happy to do the same for us. I have no doubt you'll prove persuasive. Yeah, to a gun to his head. Oh, she's still busy. Well, whatever. I'll make it a left instead of a right. Mr. DeWitt, look. Good at places any to look for our new friend. It says it's on the top floor. Oh, so we go on. How long is this gonna take? Lock damn lock. Damn thing's locked. Let me see that. Oh, have matters progressed so little? I could turn this with a rake pick. Thank you, Elizabeth. We know you're smart. Done. Don't need to rub it Where'd in. Where'd you learn that? Oh, it's something I picked up a long time ago. Yeah. Our frozen Just friend let me in, okay? the trail. <laughs> Fontaine, he said we're all equal down here now. We're all in the same boat. Just want a taste of some high-class food. Splicers. I don't think they see us. Uh, I got a kill tackler. All right, this thing. Did someone get uh, in? I know. I'm gonna equip everything. I just blow it up. There. I guess they became illiterate as they their dependence on Adam became stronger. There you go, lady. Enjoy death. I made my call. Ten days, big rush, everything slapped at. Right before the prisoners are brought in. One of your piece of shit turrets. Bam! Both kneecaps. Now I'm likely a cripple locked in a jail, surrounded by maniacs. I haven't even been paid, but I don't care. Just get me out of here! I guess Ryan just cut his losses. Sorry, man. You died here. With all the nut jobs. Again with all the loaded. Wait, aren't you guys against each other? So why are you fighting me? What's your Tommy done? Uh, I lost that piece of gear. I have no idea if I equipped it. Oh, there it is. There we go. Tommy gun. I can't hack these. It sucks. Take it. 
Of my first play, the Herald said, Ed Whale has washed up at the Schubert Theater and stinks a little more with each passing night. <laughs> The Tribune called my first opera as having the effect of cancelling out all of Mozart's classics in a single caterwaul. And now, critics take me to task for my humanitarian work. If I were not there to find a home for these orphans, would these belly acres take my place? An artist once said, All critics should be assassinated. Oh, that guy has a lot of anger issues. You don't even seem safe. Nothing beats your first splice. From there, it's all downhill. The frozen frosties, the jockeys who will hand you a thousand volts as soon as look at you. You sound sympathetic. It will be the first sons of bitches who found an answer at the bottom of a bottle. Once you see them go all weak at the knees at the sight of a little sister and all her at her. They cut a less sympathetic figure. Well, you are splicer, technically, you did. Well, whatever. Then again, they did shed light on why drinkable plasmids aren't as addicted as, uh, ejection ones. I don't know if I should spoil that. Alright, I need the shock jock D. Short circuited. Probably be able to pop it open with the a jolt of shock jockey. You familiar with shock jockey? More than you could know. Well, let's look around. Maybe there's a store. Or ain't been ransacked by splicers yet. So many loading screens. Can't hear my I've always been there for you. Just gonna beat him to death. Save some ammo. I don't know how they haven't starved to death. It's not in my concern though. Need three lockpicks. Right, maybe I should have watched my own videos. Head upstairs, grab some more stuff. Come on, buddy, I just need to kill you. What are you aiming at? Glitch out on me. Alright. Oh, right, it's up. Come on, hop on the damn thing. It took them forever to react. Like, oh, I just saw my friend get pummeled or whatever. What the? Something tells me all that cold isn't just coming from the ice rink. Alright, this music is gonna annoy the hell out of me. I just wanna get in here and get the. Old man went there and leave. Hunting rifle. I know I switch weapons. Don't need to keep reminding me. God, I hate ice skating. The first time I went, I fell so many times. Never went back. Oh, 
Maybe I should snuck up on him instead. Why can't I move? Alright, this time I got Thanks. this. You wanna thank me? Next How would you try helping me? Oh my god. Such bullshit.